Hi, welcome to At The Computer. We're still joined by world famous cosplayer Katie. She's got something special for us. Toho! That's right, she's a leading expert, a Toho cosplayer. We're gonna be playing episode six, Embodiment of the Scarlet Devil. Wait, I have an idea. Katie, you're a cosplayer. Have you ever thought about cosplaying as Blinks the Time Sweeper? You know, you get a little oh, vacuum. Oh, gross, Bruce, keep your furry agenda out of here. That shit blinks, sucks. Man. Hey, you should cosplay as Tony Hawk. Hey, you get a helmet, Tony a Hawk's like 50 you can years ride down old, the LA he's old as fuck. No, he's cool as hell. Voodoo Vince, you get pins on no you. No one wants to see like, that. Uh, oh, Katie, Dynasty Stewart. Oh, yeah, Dynasty Stewart. characters, with super With all the cool. women in, like, bikinis and swords. I mean, yeah, that's cool, too, I mean, but yeah. Katie can cosplay as, like, Lu Bu or Zhao Dun. Actually, Have actually, I'll just stick to Toho. I mean, it's okay. All right. Embodiment of the Scarlet Devil at the computer. Welcome to Toho Project Embodiment of the Scarlet Devil. Your eyes are not being deceived. This is not a Newgrounds Flash game. This is an actual computer game from the year 2002. Uh, copyright by Zun. Katie, who is Zun? Tell me about this man. Um, He is the sole creator of Toho Project. Um, but not only that, doesn't he compose the music and shit too? He does. He's crazy. So he draws all this beautiful artwork. <laughs> very nice. Very cool. He makes cool. all the music and he makes all the games. Wow. That's uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, kind of like Stanley Kubrick, but for uh, anime shit. Yeah. Can I just say that this main menu is... Uh, pretty awesome, right? Yeah. pretty. It's like a screensaver. <laughs> yeah. I want it as my background. Mm. Uh, you know, top fragger. I mean, I'm not going to do a lunatic, but I'm going to do normal... Normal fragging today. Hey, this shit gets intense. All right. Do you want to be Marissa or yeah. Raymond? I'm gonna be Mar Marissa Kirasame. That's my girl. There you go. Um, That's one probably like your most famous cosplay, right? Well, yeah. Like, famous is a weird word, but like you're you're most well known. For yeah, that definitely. Cosplay. Yeah. All right, check out this badass shit. You know, people have played like Raiden, where you're shooting like tanks and like giant airplanes. This game, we are fighting uh, Christmas fairies, angels. Yeah. Oh, fairies. Okay. So, Katie, um, I mean, this is our, there's a lot going on here, you know, so I don't want people to get too overwhelmed or overstimulated, but can you uh, <laughs> increase our context? What is Toho? Um, so, it is a series of games. Um, it started with the PC-98 ones, I believe. Hell yeah. And uh, they're mostly about Raymu or Marissa, and they hear that something's up, something's going on. And so they go to Are they fix witches? It. Are they like Marissa's a witch, Raymu is a shrine maiden. Okay, so is this like Harry Potter? Did they get like a letter saying they're wizards? No, like uh, I believe that Marissa had to study and that Raymu was born with the powers. Wow, okay. Um but Kinda so like they the chosen one. they go to try to figure out what's wrong and in the process of finding out what's wrong, mess things up even more. Oh no. <laughs> so that didn't really answer my question. So are you <laughs> So is this a wizard world? I'm like I really like, what's the context here? What is this? I'm is shooting everyone, Christmas is, trees at fairies. Is everyone's is everyone a witch? Yeah. Or is everything, like, just... Is, or is it just anime? Everyone's kind of yeah. just magic in their own way. Okay. okay. Yeah. Is there, like, endings? Is there actually, actually some, like, story context? Or is it all things that fans have, like, pulled out of yeah, games? Yeah, so there's actual, like, uh, dialogue in these games. Not voice dialogue, but mm. there's stories in these games. Oh, yeah, oh check this out. Katie, can you do this cutscene? This feeling. It's kind of... Do, do, do. Oh, I actually oh, no. Oh. I'm not her, though. I hate the night. Okay. I just like Katie. Yeah. There you go. There are only weirdos around this time. That's yeah, true. Like Whoa. that one. Who are you calling a weirdo? <laughs> Nobody's talking about you here. Oh, the yokai of darkness. That's Rumia. Not cool. Of course not. Are these the same So person? why are you stretching out your arms? <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this is a boss? This is kind of dark. She's being crucified? Fuck yeah. All right, let's fuck her up. Oh, no, she spin. She spin. <laughs> so am I actually shooting Christmas trees? No. <laughs> they look like Christmas trees. You can pretend. Okay, what are they? <laughs> uh, oh, shit, I was looking at my notes. I, they're just beams of light. All right, beams of light. All right, I'll buy it. So Katie, how did you get into Toho? It's not, I'll be fair, this isn't as cool as Hatsune Miku. So what, what drew you to this? Um, I had a friend that was really, really into it. And uh, just by wanting to... Uh, learn more about what she liked. I read up about it and then myself got really into it. Oh, okay. So like the, I mean, I'm just gonna be honest. These games don't really come off as like, they don't come off as like they would deserve like a giant fan base. Like when did the fans take these games and run away with them? Like when did this become a big thing? I'm actually not sure because I mean, it's been around for a while now. 
but I think that the fans really like because a lot of it is just uh, like free to use IPs. Well, same shit like with that scene in YouTube. Yeah. It's like, all right, Zune or whatever made oh. these games, but then people like. You can do whatever you want with cosplayed the Cosplayed it. There's all these like yeah. shareware games that people have made, all these spin offs mm -hmm. and stuff. Oh, so people are like making like art books, comic books. Yeah, about exactly. Yeah. Okay. Fan art. So, so as long as you don't recreate and sell the original games, you're allowed to do whatever you want oh, with it. I, kinda, I didn't know that. I kind of get that then. Yeah, so it's very fan based. Yeah. And so, like, so Zune is someone who's apparently, like, it seems like he's down with, like, all this fan attention. Like, yeah. as a creator, what is Zune like? I just know, doesn't he really like beer? Yeah, he loves beer. He actually has his own brand of beer. Um, he seems pretty chill from whatever I've seen of him. He's, like, is, Does he, like, going. go out to conventions? Like, Hideki Anno hates conventions. Is yeah. Zune, like, sociable? Is Zune, like, yes. a rock star? He, like, he, he owns the Toho stuff? Yeah, like, he, uh, I mean, there's its own Toho convention in Japan. It's What's an it entire... Called? Oh my god, what is it called? Rei Tai Sai. Oh, whoa. Yeah, it's called Rei Tai Sai. And uh, he actually came a couple years ago to Anime Expo. Hell and yeah. Did you meet him? Yeah, and he loved it. He Hell was yeah. so happy to meet American fans. How were does... You, were you dressed up as Marissa during that? No, I oh. wasn't. Oh, were you dressed up as Hatsune Miku? Did you get jealous? No, I wasn't. I don't think I was dressed up at all. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, just Katie, Katie meeting yeah. Zoom. Yeah, we're yeah, he'll come back. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, so... You, so, I still don't see what, why are people nuts about Toho? It, I mean, it, there ex, it exists beyond just these bullet hell games, yeah. right? What's like dope in the fan world? Are people fucking making movies out of this or what? People are, they make their own uh, animes actually. Oh, yeah. Like there's full animes all made by fans. Um, but for me personally, I think I just like the characters and how they interact with each other. Okay. I just really like that it's a world full of girls and there's nothing like perverted or weird about yeah. it. It's just, I mean, they're fighting each other, but a lot of them are friends too. Yeah, it's kind of like Mean Girls, you know, they're just, just getting rid of <laughs> Yeah, and I, they're all interesting in their own right. So it's fun to learn more about them and get connected with them. Now, did Zoon, like, did he create all the Tohos? Because there's like, how many Tohos are there? Like, how many characters Isn't are there? Isn't there like 14 official ones or something? Yeah. So he created 14, and then everyone's made like their own OCs and stuff like that. Well, then, they're not OCs. Like, people no. take the, the already created characters and just expand more on them. Okay, okay. So people aren't out there creating their own. Yeah, there's no tohos. like Sonic shit. Yeah, no, okay. nothing like okay. that. Frank the. Frank the Echidna. Yeah, can we get a drawing <laughs> of Frank as Toho? That yeah, was. that'd be good. Give him a funny hat. Oh no. Okay. Frank loves funny hats. Yeah, that's my, I love that's funny my hats. thing. I'm like, I, I, whenever I think of Frank, I think of a funny <laughs> hat. Funny hat, dude. Can't leave my house without it. Um, so they recently put out a fucking Toho on PS4 and Switch. Have you played that one? Uh, I have the PS4 one. Matt got it for me for Christmas oh, last year. Yeah. Is it... And then I took the PS4. Yeah, now I can't play it anymore. Did that, now, is that one self-produced by Zune, or did you have a larger team working on uh, it? Uh, that one is a different team. Whoa, so it's unsanctioned. Well, I mean, it's fair to use, but... So, yeah. But is it, is it cool? Is it, was it whack? Like, what... What, I think it's it? really easy compared Ooh, to these shit. games. It, it's kind of like a bullet hell, but it's in 3D, so you can go around the other characters mm. completely. And so that makes it easier to me, but I do like how you can just run up to the character and kick them in the face if you want oh, to, because you can't do that in these games. Is the is the Switch game a Bullet Hill game? Uh, I believe it's, it's the same one. Isn't yeah, it the port? same it's one. The, it's yeah, the PS4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, when it comes to Bullet Hell games, I uh, oh, I didn't mean to use my bomb. I love Geometry Wars. Like that's my shit. Uh, when Geometry Wars Two came out, I was like number thirty in the world on pacifism. Uh, so that's my crowning accomplishment. Yeah. I like like Capcom's bullet hell games, but I'm not fuck. Like we we played uh, Metal Slug. Like I like these games, but I'm not someone who tries to like one credit clear them or go nuts with them. I like playing passively, as you can see here. Mm -hmm. um, what's your like experience? Because you like Toho as like a franchise, but are, you're not like super hardcore with these games. Right? Yeah, I'm actually pretty bad at the original games, and so I tend to. You know, I listen to the music and listen to the fan music. Oh, shit, shit, shit. And I'm into yeah. more stuff like that. Like, I'm more of a fan of the things fans have made. Yeah. Uh, oh, shit. Yeah, some of the, I mean, like, I haven't looked at them, but, like, they started... Didn't, they, didn't the first one come out, like, in the late 80s or something? Like, yeah, I think so. On the PC-98. There's yeah. something super charming about PC-98 games in Japan. Like, the music is, like, great. The art is awesome. Um, but, like, so much of it's untranslated, so I never really dig deep into it. But, uh... 
fuck, I always just see PC98 art on Tumblr. I'm getting, I'm getting deep into the zone. Can you talk about the music <laughs> in this thing? Because I think the first thing with Toho I dug was like a cover of Bad Apple. Is that like a Toho song? Yeah, so that's a cover of one of the songs in here. Hell yeah. Um, like this song that we're listening to right now, Chirino's theme, is one of the other more popular ones. They made Chirino's Perfect Math Class. Oh, is that a song or a game? It's a song and it's made by Yosis, who's like really famous. And that song has like gone on to be in like other memes. Like, is it like about fractions? Yeah. Yeah, it is. You gotta add she, it she, up. She has, to, like, uh, she has to add how many buses in Gensokyo there are and Whoa, stuff dude, like BB that. Whoa, dude, 90 would love that song. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> live stream it on Facebook. Yeah, yeah but um, yeah, I'm definitely into the fan-made stuff. Like, even the fan-made games, I like uh, Super Marissa Land and Toho Mon and stuff like that. Jesus Christ. So have you cosplayed anyone else from Toho besides Marissa? Yeah, I've made a ton. Oh, a yeah. I'm just so not in... Not yeah, really I've made, I think Flandre was my first one, and she's in this game too, and then it was Marissa, and then, oh my god, I think it was Reimu, who's also in this game, I cosplayed a lot of this game. Bruce, have you ever, have you ever like, legitimately dressed up as a video game character? For, like, not, for, like, a video skit? Uh, no. I've never cosplayed. I dressed like you a were, skater. You were Miku that one I get, time. Yeah, there you go. Well, I was, I, I haven't had seen Miku cosplay. But that's for, like, a performance. I still wear, yeah. but it's still, like, <laughs> I wear it as slightly as a joke. Yeah. yeah. Like, I think it I doesn't look, fit you. Yeah, I think I look cute in it, but yeah, no, it's it's a <laughs> women's medium, but like a Japanese women's medium because uh -huh. it's so small, uh, it's tiny. The skirt fits me and stuff, but the jacket doesn't fit me. Oh, there you go. I have to wear an undershirt. Well, now you gotta get a, a fucking Toho costume. But did it like? I don't know, isn't there a slightly viral video of you and Katie cosplaying? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, what, what year was that? Was that 2011? I think 2012. There's a video, so I, like, I go to Anime Expo every year, uh, Nico Nico or whatever does, always does like a live stream where people can like well, interact. they used to. Yeah, they used to, I'm sure, I don't know why they stopped. Uh, <laughs> but like where people on the convention floor can interact with like the anonymous people on the internet and there'd always be a host and like what I would do every year is just come by and just be fucking stupid on stream. Mm -hmm. And there's one year I was dressed as a juggalo and Katie was Marissa. And we were just, we were being interviewed, uh, like, because the, the host was generally, like, blown away by Katie's cosplay or whatever, and was asking her toe questions. And then I was with her, so she would ask Katie a question, ask me a question. I would answer in character as a juggalo. Um, and so, like, I don't know, it's just, uh, this is a very good well, video. What's funny about that video is, like, you're in character as a juggalo, but then they're asking you, so, like, what are you guys looking for? What's your favorite anime? Oh, and Revolution Frank's, Girl, you Frank's like, you Revolution Girl, you yeah. yeah. And all the comments are, like, good taste? Yeah, good yeah. Taste? <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's very, very, I do a freestyle rap. It's just like, I don't know, it was a very good moment of just Whoever like... Whoever uploaded that video changed the title. It's now Marissa and the Juggalo parentheses Frank Howley, yeah, and I go. don't get any credit. There you go, no uh, credit, no credit. I mean, that's what usually happens when you work with Frank Howley. You know, all, all, all the credit goes to one source. You know, it's just like Zune, you know. Uh, people can do what they want after, but I do all the hard work after, you know. Oh, thanks. Who's that? Who's this girl? That's Chen. Well, is no, Chen that's is, not Chen. Is, that's is Mei Chinese Mei girl. Oh, come on. Hong? May Dude, nice to meet you. Mei Ding. Uh, let me see. I like her. Is she a friend or a foe? Uh, she's the guard of the castle she's you're going to. She's a normal to. person who just guards. She's not a guard. She's All the art yeah. in this game looks like it was like Deviant art. I like guess it, you'll have to punish it me. It looks like it Whoa. was like smeared in Vaseline or I'm something. Punish her. She looks like fucking, she looks like the Lucky Charms guy. What's his name? Lucky Charms guy? Who's the Lucky Charms guy called? I don't fucking know. Is this, does he have a name? Captain Crunch? No, that's... The Leprechaun. I don't know. Lucky what? Charms Leprechaun. Isn't he just Lucky the Leprechaun? Lucky the Leprechaun. Okay, there we go. Is he, oh. is he like the Apple Man? Like Apple Jack's man? I'm cinnamon? Apple and I'm Cinnamon. Is there Toho and together, is there, we're is there, is there Toho cereal? No, I wish. Damn. All right. I mean, yeah, I would, hey, Bullet Hell cereal would work out because all the bullets the Little look, pebbles, yeah. yeah they look you like can spin your spoon around yeah. and make it look like it's swirling. Yeah. Holy shit. All right. Know, it's a million dollar, million dollars idea. You can Frank, do it. Okay, well, Frank, you're playing this game. What do you think of this game? Uh, a little boring. Okay. Uh, I like the music. That's kind of it. I, th it's, but it's from 2002. Um, but the music in Toe is fucking dope. I respect that it's one guy making these games for like two decades. That's pretty cool. That's kind of it. I don't give a fuck about the story. I would, you know, skip the cutscene. It's kind of my preference. I mean, that's your purpose of every game. Uh, yeah, but like, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, there's something hypnotic about bullet hell games. When you get into it, you're powering up, and if you die, you get punished. Like, you get into this flow, like, right now. Like, it's kind of fun. But yeah, I mean, this shit's from 2002, so it doesn't hold up very well. Katie, what's your favorite Toho? Like, game or character? Yeah, game. Uh, my favorite Toho game is Mountain of Faith. Mount, which one's that? Uh, what's it on? Is it on just PC? Yeah, it's, uh, I which, don't remember number what is number it, it is, is it, actually. Is it, like, 2000s, 90s? It's pretty close to this game. Okay, okay. 
And then what's your favorite? Is I guess Marissa is your favorite Toho? Uh, no, so, actually, no? No. Uh, Moko is my favorite Toho. Moko? What did you look like? Uh, she got silver hair and big red pants. Big red pants. Hell <laughs> yeah. How about that? Oh, it's Santa Claus. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. All right, Toho at the Scarlet Devil. Uh, you know, version 1.02, maybe the English patch version 1.02. You know, 60, you know, English patch, you know, 60 frames to the uh, copyright. Spencer. <laughs> Spencer. 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 I downloaded this game. I downloaded this game off the internet, oh, and there was friend. already a save built in there. So let's take a look at Spencer. <laughs> this is my game. <laughs> so far, so good. All right. So let's see what Spencer did. The guy said in the upload notes, if you want to have a clear save, go in and delete it. But I didn't. So you know, just want to see. Oh yeah. Let's see how good he is. Oh, classic Spencer. Right classic here. Spencer move right here. Oh, Sp man, Spencer's a lot better at this game than Can you, you like, legally buy these games anywhere, or is it just like... Yeah, they're sold for like five bucks. Okay, well, Frank, they're not on Steam, though. Frank, you couldn't no. spend the five I blew all my budget on our next game, so oh, okay. you'll have to wait. <laughs> um, where do people get this, though? Is this like from, like, Steam? It's not on Steam. How do is people it, find like, these? Is it on, like, Play Asia or something like that? I think that, like, some, like, J-List might sell it, something like that, but I know that a lot of American retailers sell it for, like, 30 or 40 bucks, which Jesus. is ridiculous. And we were, the, you guys were at Target the other day, and they were selling the Toho on Switch and Target. Yeah, for 30 bucks. Yeah. Well, Spencer's owning that. He's good. Oh, he's his mom. Not as good as me. Don't get carried away. I mean, yo, Don't get carried I, I away. He's playing on Lunatic right No, now. he's playing on the easy. I, nah, I was playing on Lunatic. No, I think, no. Yeah, I, I think my moves are a little bit better. This is like, this is just, you know, you kind of showing off. How do he do that? Oh, shit. See, okay, when people play this shit on Lunatic, I can't play it, but watching it online, I fucking, it's like amazing. It's yeah, so cool. it's mesmerizing. Yeah. Seeing all the lights and shit. Well, I feel like Spencer is going to do a good job. This looks like fidget spinners in the background. Anyway, whoa, who's this? Oh, that's Pachuli. Okay, fair enough. All right, well, Spencer will play through the rest of this game. Uh, we're going to go work on our costumes. What's the fi what's your final word that takes out? Uh, let's all make fun hats. We'll... Oh, Go no. cosplay together. All right, sounds like a plan. So that was Toho Project Episode 6, Embodiment of the Scarlet Devil. There's a dozen of these games. They're all the same to me, but for the fans, the dedicated, Katie, what's your take? Uh, I think this is a good starting point. This is kind of where I started. It's a good story. You can... Great story. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty easy to follow. Uh-huh. Yeah, so if you want to check it out, I'd recommend this one. How many thumbs, though? How many thumbs? Oh, uh... One. Wow! Oh, Skyrocket! Right, yeah. Wow! All <laughs> right, let the critic like, let the, two, the critic but, take know. over. Uh, Toho as a fandom, as a thing, it's pretty interesting because one person created this weird fucking anime empire. Um, I haven't played the hyper early games, but like it's still charming. Anytime someone, an indie developer, makes a really small game and it blows up, mm. that's cool. The game itself, coming into it. Okay, it's it's worth as worth it as like video game history, but it, like I didn't have really fun playing this. Whatever, music is cool. Mm -hmm. um, Toho as a thing is neat, but the game itself, no thumbs. Toho as a movement, I give it a thumbs up. So that's kind of my my split split word. Bruce, uh, for me personally, I don't want to hold this. Um, it's right, dirty. It. No, it's, um, it's but you know, <laughs> me personally, I don't really like the music in Toho at all. What? Don't like it. To me, it's like super like tinny. And like, just like super, like it just hurts my ears. It's it's ear piercing. Not a fan. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. That's for later. Um. But like, I don't like the the gameplay is like fine. Whatever. I mean, I'm just gonna give it a thumbs down. I don't like it that much. It's Toho, too hard for him. Toho as a hey man. I'm halfway through Cuphead right now. Yo, you you. It's hey, Frank. I heard this. that you played Cuphead on easy. No, that's not true. Yeah, that's that's not true. That's what that's I heard. Not, don't that's, say that's that in front of Katie. That's what I heard. Cool. All right. Um. I think thumbs down to host. All right, whatever. You can email us your opinions uh, at thecomputershow at gmail.com. You can leave us comments. You can follow us on Twitter. I am at Frank Howley. I'm underscore Brewsims. And I'm at Clover Club Cost. Leave comments. No fuckheads. Uh, you know, I don't care if uh, you worked on Toho. Zun, don't be rude. Get out of here, Zun. Zun, Zun, you know, let the, let the fans hey, come speak. to my Twitter. I welcome the fuckheads. Yeah, you know, all the fuckheads I, at Brewsims. I'm, I'm the fuckhead Anyways, Twitter. Thanks for watching at the computer. Um, I hope you have a horrible new year. I hope you don't make it across. So, you know, this is the end. Jeez. We'll see you at the computer.